Welcome to a tutorial of FB Reader version 1.0.9 on iOS. This video was created with support from the Government of Canada's Social Development Partnerships Program Disability Component. The opinions and interpretations in this video are those of the creator and do not necessarily reflect those of the Government of Canada. It was produced with cited assistance. FB Reader offers an interface that is fairly easy to learn and use. While there is no Read to End feature, a simple tap on the screen will cause the current page to be narrated. It supports books in EPUB 2, along with a variety of text formats. They can be copied to FB Reader right from the NELS repository, or sideloaded from Dropbox. However, because it was designed for the mainstream market, FB Reader is not recommended for those new to VoiceOver. Here, we're looking at the record for Treasure Island on the NELS website. When we press Download EPUB, we're asked where to store the book. You may need to press More first, but we're going to select Open in FB Reader. Treasure Island is now open in FB Reader, showing up in the reading pane. Unfortunately, VoiceOver can't navigate the text of the book. However, if you tap and hold in the middle of the screen, it will read the page out loud to you. Sounded louder and higher as if he were afire with eagerness and rage. In, in, in he shouted, and cursed them for their delay. Buttons to open library, show book details, and show info are found at the top left of the screen. Now, because FB Reader uses voiceover swipe gesture to turn pages, it's important to only swipe to controls with your finger at the very top or bottom of the screen. To read a different book, tap the top left of the screen then swipe right to open library. This brings you back to the main screen, where all your books are shown. Swipe through the list until you come to the title you wish to read, then tap the title to open it. To delete a book, double tap and hold the title you finished reading. Tap the screen directly below the book's title to highlight the pop-up, then swipe to delete. Finally, press delete once more to confirm. Back in the reading pane, if you want to pull up the table of contents, just press Show Book Info. This button is found just to the right of Open Library. Swipe through the list that appears and tap a chapter to go there in your book. You can press Show Info next to Show Book Details to find out the book's title and author. A brief synopsis will also be shown here if it's available. To find text in your book, press Search, found at the top right of the screen. Type in the phrase you wish to find, then press Search on the right side of the keyboard. FB Reader will then position you on the next page that contains your query. Several buttons are found at the bottom left of the screen, but these deal mostly with visual adjustments. An undo button is located at the bottom right. Between these controls is found the percentage bar, which shows how many pages you have read. FB Reader handles a wide array of content and works well with voiceover.